the need for working, it's their livelihood. I mean, if they can't get to work or to a grocery store or to a social function, they have no where to go. BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three Minutes With is brought to you by Farmers National Bank. For WRTA, pre-COVID, we're transporting 1.5 million people a year. And based on our surveys, over half of them, or about half of them, were going to work. So with over 750,000 trips in a year, you can kind of see how the connection between the employment, the um, uh, business related connection between uh, transportation and the economy is. For our riders, um, the need for working, going uh, to doctor appointments, uh, we have a lot that go to school when school starts. Um, it's it's their livelihood. I mean, if they can't get to work or to a grocery store or to a social function, they have n nowhere to go. Um, I think going back to the free fairs really helps them, and I know that a lot of them really appreciate the free fairs. Uh, it helps them economically. They don't have to worry about trying to have a dollar in their pocket or anything. They could just hop on a bus, sit down, and get to their destination. What, what sort of business support are you getting uh, in WRTA? So, um, a little, we don't get a lot of one-on-one -on -one with actual companies, and we like Mom's Meal is probably the biggest one we've talked to. Um, the Chamber, on the other hand, has been our connection with the businesses, and they've worked with us Again, like TGX is another big example of the bigger size ones, but even small ones. In fact, they have a survey that they just posted because they want to get better input from the business community on what their needs are and also from residents to see what their what residents' needs are to get to uh, locations. We also do travel training for the public. So if someone's not familiar on how to use the fixed route service to go to work or anything, we have a mobility manager that will actually go out with them to their house and then walk to the bus stop and show them how to use um, whatever route it is that they need to get to where they have to go. Oh, I and see. That is free of charge. So all they have to do is call us. We also have a mobile app that um, they can do download and um, it does trip planning for them, so if they need to go somewhere, they can type in either a destination or an address. And of course, it's a smartphone, so it knows where you're at, and it will tell you the closest route to to get to go where you have to go. So it'll tell you you got to walk 10 feet to go to the bus stop, and then it'll tell you what time the bus gets there. You can see um, it updates every minute, so it's actual information. It also also tells you how many people are on the bus, the bus number, and you'll see like little spots will be all the stops. Thanks for watching the video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit that little bell for notifications. And also make sure to connect with us on Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn. For all of your business news, visit businessjournaldaily.com. For all of your arts and entertainment news, go to afterhoursyoungstown.com. BusinessJournalDaily.com. Three Minutes With is brought to you by Farmers National Bank. I like a bank that's a pillar in my community. I like a bank so cutting edge, they have a lab branch. We are so alike. Well, we do both bank at Farmers National Bank. Farmers. Stand strong.